Did George Bush have knowledge about the drug operation coming out of Central America and South America? Yes. Explain. Well, he was in one of the camps. He it, produced the cocaine. Yeah, but did he know about it? He was he, standing at a press. George was also, in addition George to Ollie. George Bush was standing right at a cocaine press. And did he have a picture of that? In a place called Roos Roos. I have a picture of something. Okay, we won't go into that. Did Clinton, do you have any direct knowledge that Clinton had, uh, was aware of the drug operation coming into Arkansas? Uh, the direct knowledge is that uh, Buddy Young was actually an uh, advisor to Clinton. He was his chief of security, and he was one on board the aircraft, and he was sent there uh, by Clinton to investigate the loss of monies that had been determined. Uh, additional direct knowledge comes in the fact that uh, one of the people called by Barr uh, was the governor of Arkansas on that SATCOM. He called North, he called the vice president from during on this 24th of March uh, conversation and he called the governor of Arkansas and talked to him. So, uh, and governor of Arkansas then was William Jefferson Clinton. So they were talking about the enterprise, about the lost monies. Uh, and additionally, in, in earlier years, in, when I was at Fort Campbell, Kentucky, I actually flew uh, several missions carrying medical coolers again uh, with money and drugs in it into uh, Arkansas. Out of where? Fort Campbell? Out of Fort Campbell. It was delivered to us by the 324th Med Battalion. Out of the South America? Out of South America. Uh, they, they were operating in the South America in, in Honduras. It was flown by C-130 to Fort Campbell. It was marked medical supplies. Donor organs, this particular one was marked. Um, and we were advised to give it to Dr. Lassiter uh, at uh, Little Rock Air Force Base. So we flew it to Little Rock Air Force Base. I opened the coolers. I don't, op I don't fly a cooler without opening it. I don't fly anything without opening it. Let me tell you why I don't fly coolers without opening them. I was told by Colby earlier that uh, Torrijos died simply because they put a uh, donor or uh, cooler marked donor, donor organs on his aircraft that blew up in flight. So whenever I see a cooler, I open that. And what did you find in the cooler? We found a, a large sum of money and three co kilos of cocaine in one cooler. In the other cooler, we found uh, all cocaine. Uh, those two coolers were picked up by Dr. Lassiter, who actually ended up being, as we found out in later years, a man named Dan Lassiter, who was convicted for trafficking cocaine in Arkansas. However, he was uh, pardoned by the then governor of Arkansas, Bill Clinton. And uh, did uh, you have any information that Clinton had direct knowledge of that? Now, you flew him into Arkansas. Was, was Clinton there?